Imagine climbing over a cliff to get to your bed. The next home on our tour is one of the world's largest and most unusual. It's twice as big as computer billionaire Bill Gates' home. Well, now. And uh, Christy guarantees that we've never seen anything like it before. Take a look. From a boat, it looks fabulously exotic. And from the ground, it seems even more so. Filled with temples, fountains, even rare birds. One of the world's largest homes. This tropical fantasy took 10 years and over $30 million to build. This is the owner, Canadian mogul Peter Nygaard, whose mega successful company makes women's clothing sold everywhere from Saks to Sears. It's like a personal resort. It's big. It's about 150,000 square feet. In fact, Peter's home is so big that guests need electric cars to move around the compound's four acres. You're going to drive into your <laughs> yeah, house? we're going to drive into your house. Peter designed the place himself, ensuring that each of the 20 bedrooms has magnificent views. Each room has a name and a personality. This one is called Cliffhanger, built so it literally dangles over the sea. Come on, this is truly Robinson Crusoe. This oh is... my gosh. Oh you my. watch our rocks. Oh this is the ultimate water bed. Yeah. Peter says he built his home to go back to nature. And so he used native materials everywhere, from this shell sink to this wooden tub. Naturally, Peter entertains constantly here, making sure his guests enjoy every luxury from indoor-outdoor pool to full-size tennis courts. Visitors include Sean Connery, Michael Jackson, and his favorite, George Bush. Peter says his greatest pleasure now is improving his fantasy home. 150,000 square feet. That is a lot. Can I tell you, he loves spending money, and the next thing he's going to do is build a huge lagoon that you dive into, swim to a cave, and you'll find a disco in a wet bar. <laughs> is that cool or what? I just said to Christy, I am not living large enough, I reckon. <laughs> Thank you so much, Christy. Thanks for having Thank me. Thank you so much.